Really? This city group might finance a whole new setup. Geez, Noel must be stoked. Don't start counting your chickens yet, mate. It's only a meeting. Better than caving, letting Josh win. Yeah? Yeah, I suppose so. I'll uh, have to overnight at Morax. Uh, you'll be all right in your own here. You could go to Irene's. Please. I'm nearly 18. I think I can manage one night. Oh, yes. I keep forgetting you're almost grown up. You'd never know from the look of your room. No wild parties, all right? No, Uncle Alf. And no alcohol? No, no. And no funny business? Definitely no funny business. Just don't do anything I wouldn't do, all right? That should give me plenty of scope. Really, the whole place to ourselves? All night. We better make the most of it, then. That's what I was thinking. Mm -hmm. He has given us all of our no-nos, though. Oh, uh, let me guess. Parties, drugs, alcohol. And no funny business. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll tell Dad I'm going to the drop-in centre then? Can you be as quick as you can? What do you think? Yeah, sorry, please, yeah. What's that smell? You did look pretty funny standing there with those burnt oven mitts on. Now the whole flat stinks, and all I was trying to do is make everything perfect. All I can smell is your aftershave. I only did it a bit. It's so beautiful. I mean it. I'm always trying to say it. It just gets stuck in my throat. I love you. You're about to call me Kirsty. I'm sorry, Jade. I didn't mean to. That that just came out. This was a mistake. No, Jade, don't go. No, wait. I can explain. I'm just a consolation prize, aren't I? All this time you're pretending I was Kirsty. Jade, please. I mean, you have to believe me. I'm really nervous. Okay. I was thinking about Kirsty. Yeah. But it was that night that she didn't come. But I'm glad she didn't, because if she had, then we might have never gotten together. See, the thing is, I, just, I can't believe my luck. I just really want it to be special, you know? I know. It will be. Do you think we should go to the bedroom? Are you sure, then? Yeah, I'm totally sure. Are you? Yes. Go. Not so good. I didn't expect to see you up and at him. Yeah. So, uh, did you have a good night then? It's pretty uneventful. Uneventful, eh? We uh, have a bit of a fire, did we? Oh, yeah, something like that. <laughs> oh, well. I suppose at least the joint's not full of empty bottles. That is, unless you've uh, cleared them away already. Come on, Uncle Alf. Joke, mate, joke. No, I had a quiet night. Good. Well, sometimes they're the best, uh, as long as you enjoyed yourself. So the, the city people had no luck with them then? No. Oh, they were very nice. They listened sympathetically and then they said no. Really? Why? Similar facility in Yabby Creek. You know what city people are like. No idea of distances in the country. Anyway, 
I better go and break the news to Noah. What's going on? Hey. Twins have arrived. Is she always like this? Oh, no, she was a great kid. Yeah, it was. Past tense. Let's get out of here. See you guys. Yeah. <laughs> so, what are you listening to? I'm really into Eminem. You know, he rocks. Okay, whatever. Now I know how people feel when someone invades their country. Oh, please, it's not that bad. You want to make a bet? They're impossible. Matilda hasn't stopped complaining since she walked through the door and Henry hasn't said a word. I think I might have to join the circus. Imagine if it was you guys. Their entire lives have been turned upside down. Oh, yeah, but they don't even know that yet. What's going to happen when they find out it's permanent? It's all going to hit the fan. <laughs> You'll be happier than the Brady Bunch before you know it. Not us. Well, that's for sure. If it never gets too much, you could always move out. Yeah, right. Don't I just love that? We should probably just give it a go. I still think the circus is a good idea. I'm about to switch on the machine, and I see this. That looks like a necklace young Jade wears. I, well, that was my first thought. Then I asked myself, what would Jade's necklace be doing in with Seb's sheets? Doesn't seem possible. Or does it? Yeah, well, I guess it is possible. I think she was um, sitting on the end of my bed, actually. Seb, mate, look, uh, if you're going to stay here, there are rules. Tell the truth, be responsible, and show respect. I expect all of those things from you. Yeah, well, uh, absolutely, Uncle Alfred. I will. Good. Well, uh, that's it, then. That's it? Hmm. You keep telling me you're 18. <laughs> so, uh, just one other thing. Young uh, Jade is a very nice girl. You make sure you do the right thing by her, all right? I will. You can count on that. Good. See you later. <laughs>